today we are discussing about the uh, target transformation in the target transformation i am selecting a source as a employee stable as well as i am selecting the target as uh, t underscore employees target t underscore employees then i am doing here insert operation before going that i have to clear that uh, code table uh, t underscore employees then I inserted slash star from t underscore employees then we go here we don't we do not have any data and we do save here and then we run click on run and go to my jobs and see the data has processed or not click on refresh the rows are processed which is uh, cloud so we have to connect to the cloud that's why it is taking time so the rows are processed so I then I see the details we are having RKRD and King and all the details so I want to go here I want to modify the source table the source HR table employees instead of RK ready I am giving RK and I am committing this uh, record I, this is saved and I do the uh, update strategy here then we see target go to target and we see update strategy and I want to add employee ID here and then I save here then I want to run so here what will happen is that only one record is updated or it's uh, all records are updated let's see here so click on refresh button and see the results you tell only one record is updated or it's appends of total records guess friends it appends all the 107 records why because it is updated all the 107 records now see we are having in the core table rkrd now i am getting rk means we hear all the details uh, means it is appended all all not appended it is replaced with the old records and again it is inserted and it's all means it is all updated at single stretch uh, without uh, only the modified column now see this is regarding uh, our uh, target transformation update strategy and insert strategy and if you do have offset also same it is an update and delete so if you are having to go insert a new table new one is going to up, uh, insert and it's going to delete its new delete so if i want to delete any column means guess here so Here I am this employee is there. I want to delete that selected row and I am committing. So we are having a child record found. So instead of that I am going another record uh, Nina. We see Nina record. I am doing deleting here and I am committing so Nina also child record is there uh, 106 uh, valley bc yeah, and delete is it have any child no 106 is deleted now I am going for delete <coughs> now I am going for delete operation guess 
is all the records will deleted only 106 is deleted tell and comment in the comment box okay okay what will delete if all the records are deleted or only 106 is deleted guess anybody you guess you guess guys okay this is very important only 106 is deleted is all the records deleted let's see here so 106 so i i deleted 106 record so now you see here only 106 record is there means whatever the records are there in the source table that are comparing to our target table and that is all going to delete depending on the primary key of employee id okay this only 106 is remained here okay that is the delete operation has done here so uh, for deletion of 106 we go for the SED types and we will tell in the upcoming videos uh, before that please subscribe and like yeah okay now we see uh, another uh, things uh, this kind of things is uh, there in the target transformation okay thank you uh, we will see in the next episode uh, next uh, video uh, SED types okay done thank you bye